did you get locked out? I'm afraid little Eric put a lock on the door to keep me out. I'm sure he has the passcode written down here somewhere. What's that? You want to spank me? Oh well, all right. Fuck. You. Mom. That's not enough, Mosquito! We have to act fast before the Freedom Pals can! If there is someone in this town who knows someone who works at Netflix, then we have to find that person today! But we were gonna start our franchise plan with movies. The Super Craig Netflix series comes later. We can start with the Netflix series. You know that's what Freedom Pals are thinking. But who in this town could have a connection to Netflix? It could be anybody. That is what we must find out, Fast Pass. Mosquito, you run ABLs on all known Freedom Pals activity. Human Kite and Fast Pass, see what you can learn about their POIs. Super Craig, just, I don't know, browse the internet or something. Let's go, Coon Friends! How'd you get into here? Move along, I'm on confidential coon business. That Galaxy Cube is a super powerful artifact from space, so don't touch it. It's called the Galaxy Cube because it can destroy the galaxy. Hey, 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 hey! Do not touch that! That device can blow up the entire Milky Way galaxy, Jesus, fuck! Mom! The new kid is trying to play with the Cube of Ultimate Destruction! You be nice to all your friends, Eric. Be a good sharer. Good sharer? It'll blow up the fucking galaxies! Stupid bitch! Look, dude, we already told you, you can't play. You aren't a superhero. You don't have a costume. You don't have any superpowers. Freedom Pals are adding people to their franchise. We should be adding people to ours. This dork? Like, wearing a little crown? Does this look like a superhero to you? <sighs> all right, all right, have a seat, douchebag. Not there. That's Mysterion's seat. Not there either, stupid. Alright, in order to play superheroes, you have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Coonstagram. Do you have a Coonstagram page? Oh boy, you're not even on Coonstagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. Fucking unbelievable. Let's see. So the first thing we need to fill out on your character sheet is your class. You know, what kind of superhero are you? Speedster, ah yes, like the Flash or Quicksilver, I like it. Okay, douchebag, but now, we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. You lay awake that night, like so many other nights. You couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and you felt alone. And that's when it happened. A loud noise. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. You left your room. You left your room. Out in the hallway, you saw two intruders in front of your parents' door. You had to stop them from hurting your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them. So for the first time, you called upon your speedster powers. As a super fast speedster hero, you bent space time itself to spring into action with super speed. You moved in closer to the intruder. Once his atoms returned to their original positions, the intruder realized what he was up against. Damn, we weren't expecting a superhero to live here. Desperately, the intruder struck our hero. Take this! <laughs> Emboldened, his fellow intruder moved into the fray. You don't scare us, superhero. But the intruders were only moving closer to their demise. You vibrated every subatomic particle to become an unstoppable high-energy body. Hey, what's the kid doing now? Once charged, you only needed one...
turn to defeat the hapless intruders. First, you gave the second intruder a taste of your atom-smashing quantum fist! You are! Shit, my atoms! With both intruders weakened, there is nothing they could do against the hero's final strike, a supersonic dash! Ah! Oof! He was just too speedy! With the intruders soundly defeated, you thought you were safe, until a third massive intruder entered the fray, bigger than the other two intruders could bend! Ah! <laughs> I just flushed one little shit, now here's one more! Before you could react, he swung his gargantuan fist into your small body, doing critical damage! <laughs> you were hurt, yes, but the intruder had made a critical mistake. He pissed you off. Summoning the last of your strength, you tapped into your ultimate ability, the Multiverse Strike! So you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw... You saw your dad fuck your mom. Wow. That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted, fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? Alright, now you need to go out into the town and do superhero stuff. You know, help people and fight crime and dumb shit like that. There's some starting costumes in the wardrobe, and remember, if you ever want to try out a different class, just come talk to me. And get that character sheet completely filled out! You're not playing with us until you do! We were supposed to be a duo, remember, Tweak? Yeah, I remember. So when I walked out on Coon and Friends, you should have walked out with me. I like Coon and Friends. Because you had your own movie. Thank God you're here. They're really going at it. Super Craig had to have movies before Wonder Tweak was introduced. It made no sense otherwise. Your whole group makes no sense. Because you're a traitor, Tweak, and now you're with a group of super traitors. This was started by you. By people who thought there should be preferential treatment to certain heroes. We aren't the ones who walked out of the fucking franchise, Mysterion. Eric, you must listen to me. Right now, I'm speaking to you telepathically. Get out of my head, Timmy. Your franchise is going nowhere. Face the truth, Eric. You guys are kind of douchebags. He just called us douchebags in my mind. He did? All right, you son of a bitch. Ha! <laughs> Motherfucker! Good friends, deal with these assholes! Freedom Pals is the future, kid. I just hope you realize that before it's too late. New kid, don't let Cartman fool you! Bring down the lightning! Oh. Ah, Jesus, we calm down. It's a bird! It's a kite! It's a human kite! Uh. Kite, you're fighting for the wrong side! This is my time. It's Craig time. I mean, super Craig time. Ah. Oh! Woo! Shake it off! Car! Car! Stay out of the street, you damn kids! Fuck you, dude. It's Civil War, dick. Clear! Clear! Think about what you're doing, you kid! What the?
Cartman's only working for himself, new kid. I'll put you on ice! Time to fly! Hey. Ah! Be careful where you're shooting that laser, man! Craig time. I mean, super Craig time. Ah, yeah. Now it's my turn. Ah! Well, sorry, New Kid, but you're just on the wrong team. New Kid's gonna kick your ass, Freedom House. There's a storm coming. my mind. You okay? No, seriously, you guys. He fucked the shit out of my brains. Uh, I grabbed him. We fought for a little bit, but his, his mental powers are too strong. So we did all that for nothing? Not quite. I got Timmy's cell phone. You did? There's sure to be a lead on that. Let's get this back to base. Super Craig can analyze it. <laughs> 